my name is Joshua Shirley, and this is my Camel High School International Skills Diploma SEAL video. The International Baccalaureate Program offers a diverse array of courses that empower us to perceive the world's challenges and events from a holistic and global standpoint. While I've delved into the core subjects such as biology, mathematics, and even environmental science, all courses that are extremely normal for an average student, I'm particularly passionate about shedding light on the often undervalued realm of visual arts. Um, in this presentation, I aim to show you how this creative discipline not only enhances academia, but also immerses students in the world's intricate global perspectives. In this slide, I show you some of the classes I've taken and here is bolded visual arts, which I aim to delve deeper into. So in this slide, I have five of my pieces that I've used in my portfolio that take different techniques and different artistical expression, abstraction, and things like this that show you that I've, that I've um, taken inspiration from different artists globally around the world, mainly in France and Germany and other important European countries like that. So in my travel through these interesting countries like Germany and France, I've encountered inspiration that breath new life into my artistic journey. The vibrant colors in German countryside and the artistic genius embedded in the culture of France have deeply impacted my work. As after traveling to the Louvre avec, not avec, after traveling to the Louvre in my French exchange trip, it was very interesting to see how Different artists use different colors and different expressions of colors and composition within their work. And I've been inspired by this and I've implemented it into my own artistical creations. As you can see in these photos, my art has evolved through the infusion of these experiences. And I've harnessed rich and diverse palette of colors and encountered weaving, I've encountered and weaved them into my compositions to reveal immense meaning throughout my pieces. So in many of my pieces, I dive into the topics of LGBTQ youth, um, African culture and acceptance of that in the far right in this monochromatic blue piece. And I also have a piece dedicated to the Harlem Renaissance, showing my appreciation for different aspects of and eras of art. Within my extracurricular activities, um, three of my main global focus ones are French Honor Society and the French Exchange and also French Tutoring. Um, with the French Honor Society, I'm a senior member and I help induct members into this amazing club. Um, the French Exchange is one of my most favorite um, extracurriculars that I've done where I went to France and actually lived with a pa with French um, a French family and I also do French tutoring for other IB students who struggle with the class. Here I have various pictures as in the French Exchange it was with Americans, French, and Hungarian people and these connections that I made with the Hungarians were everlasting as even in this day I share videos and pictures with them and I connected with them via social media. Um, in this bottom left and top right picture, um, this was, or the top right picture, this was where I was, um, I was, I volunteered to do a podcast for the French school that I was at with other Hungarian people. And it was interesting as it was 100% French, which was actually fun as the Hungarians surprisingly spoke really good French, but I feel like it's in their culture. Um, language is often more preceded as they are in Europe and they're required to know at least three languages. In the bottom right, you can see the family that I stayed with and my pen pal is on the right next to the woman. His name is Paul and it was interesting how his English was actually not that good and I actually had to speak French most of the time and listen in French, which actually truly was 100% immersion as when I woke up, I had to talk to him in French as he didn't really understand my English and the slang that I used as slang is often something that is undermined in language learning. Uh, on the top left picture are all the Americans that were on the trip, and we have the American flag, which shows our national relationships with the Hungarians and the other French students at um, the school. In the middle picture, it's one of my closest Hungarian friends that I made, and it was interesting how we connected over music through American culture, and she also introduced me to Hungarian music, and also taught me slight Hungarian language and vernacular that was actually interesting and I use it while texting her um, via Instagram. Thank you.